So in this video I'm going to be showing you a few different products uh, that you can use when doing customs. Uh, the first product is the GAC 900. It's a fabric painting medium. Uh, this is a product that you want to mix with the Angelus paint if you're going to be uh, changing the color of, say, for example, the sock liner on your sneakers. If you're going to be doing uh, a match of laces to your sneaker design. Or, for example, on these uh, kids' Jordans, uh, you want to change the color, um, and it's not a leather material that you're painting on. Uh, so here's the bottle. Here's what it looks like. It comes in an 8-ounce bottle, and it's available on the website. It uh, It is called GAC 900 Fabric, Fabric Painting Medium. And how this works is if you are, for example, uh, doing a sock liner, you always want to get the 4-ounce jar and the 8-ounce Golden GAC. It actually will take about almost to four ounces to do a sock liner because what it does is it saturates and you have to wait for that process to dry and then you have to do layer after layer after layer to build up the layers so the perfect example here is this one here it shows one layer of the GAC with a uh, the gift box blue you let that dry and then you add your second layer this is an example of a second layer of the uh, gift box blue and the GAC and then here, after you start building up, letting layer after layer dry, um, this is what it looks like uh, after about four coats of it. And so it's really, it's really flexible, more flexible than the Angelus is just straight out of the box there. The other product that we have here is the Too Thin product. Now this product is a good product if you are trying to thin it out to put it into an airbrush. Uh, you never want to do just straight add water to the Angelus because what it does is it messes with the properties that make it flexible and self-leveling. If you break it down too much with water, you have a tendency of making it fragile and possibly causing it to crack or not adhere correctly. So the product you want to use is a too thin and it's quite liquidy, but it's still, it's sort of like a, it's sort of the same product they used to make this without any of the colors or stuff in it and uh, it helps you thin this stuff to shoot it through an airbrush machine. It comes in two sizes in the one ounce and the four ounce there for you as well. And uh, here are just a couple of examples of what you can do uh, with this color. This gift box blue is the actual uh, color match to a Tiffany uh, uh, and company box. So you don't longer have to pre-mix it. It's already ready to go except it's got the name gift box blue. And then here are just some a few examples of, of it in action. And then these are an example of uh, what I did with the products. Uh, you're, I know you're going to be asking if I could paint this. And the Air Force One, it's a particular shoe that doesn't really have a lot of flex, and this is really, really hard. So that's why the midsole is painted on it. Uh, what I did is I just added some of the uh, gift box and some GAC 900 uh, here to give it an extra little bit of flex. These laces are also dyed uh, using the gift box and the GAC 900, and the sock liner is... Um, it's turquoise in the JC down here, so you can see it in action there, what it looks like. Uh, it's, this is a really cool product if you're trying to color match some laces um, that you don't find. If you're trying to do some custom splatter on the laces as well, you can also do it that way. And just remember that you have to heat set it. Um, and when you do that, you can use a professional blow dryer. You just got to make sure to get it up to 300 degrees. If uh, you're unsure if your blow dryer gets high, you can also pick up uh, a heat gun. And this is just a Wagner one here, you see. And the Wagner one, if you get the nicer one, it comes with a, a little gauge that tells you high, low, and all that stuff there. Uh, you just got to make sure to get it right at the first setting there um, and high. And it, it, this particular model, uh, when you turn it off, it cools down. So it, it, it's, it's, a great, it's a great tool. If you have any more questions, go ahead and visit the website, or you can hit me at the email. Uh, a. Gutierrez at kingofsneakers.com. You can also check the info box below the, the video. You can hit me on there or just send some comics. Uh, I don't sometimes have enough time to get to you uh, quickly, but I promise I will respond if you ask a question on there.